How do you develop a strong brand? Well, developing strong brands uh, needs to focus on at least three aspects. The first is improve the mental availability of a brand, namely increase the level of brand awareness in the consumer's mind. Number two is improve customer's preference for the brand. Therefore, you need to focus on innovation, uh, service improvement, etc., etc., in order to achieve that objective. The third is to develop the physical availability of our brand, namely whenever customer think of this brand or when they want to buy this brand, they can easily find the brands either online and offline. Therefore, building a strong brands require building brand awareness, customer preference, and physical distribution. How does the digital era change the brand building approach? The digital era has changed the brand building process and approaches fundamentally. Uh, first, digital era offer organization to provide much more digital value to the customer. So one critical aspect of building brands in the digital era is to enhance the digital offer of your overall product and services. Second, digital era, of course, can improve the company's communication effectiveness. Co company can use social media to reach more customer more instantly. So that's also a key aspect of brand building in the digital era, namely how do we use social media platform to achieve communication effectiveness. The third is digital era allow organization to be more efficient, agile, and speedy in addressing a particular customer need. So organization needs to become digital enterprise in order to achieve that objective. That's why digital era is a fundamental paradigm shift. So the brand building strategy and practice needs to be completely revamped and re-engineered. Why is a strong brand vital for an organization? A strong brands offer organization a number of benefits. Um, first, uh, strong brands can attract more customers because strong brands often serve as a signal of quality. Uh, customer use a strong brands as a decision aid to make an easier and faster decision. Uh, strong brands can also allow the organization to expand into different product category, therefore reach more customers. Strong brands can also uh, help the company to pursue cross-selling, again, uh, reaching more customers. Uh, uh, second is strong brands, of course, allow the organization to uh, charge a higher price. We call the price premium. Uh, again, price premium is a key contributor to the increased profitability. Uh, third, but not the least, is strong brands, uh, because of the reputation, allow the organization to attract top talents uh, to be hired as their employees. So that's why our organization definitely needs to uh, uh, strive to build a strong brand in today's increasingly competitive marketplace. What are the characteristics of a strong brand? I think a strong brand should at least have the following two characteristics. Number one is very high customer awareness. Uh, everywhere in the world, customers should uh, instantly recognize a brand. Uh, second, it, it has a strong emotional bond with the customer. So customer like the brand, they trust the brand. Uh, in the ideal situation, they fall in love with the brand we call a uh, high customer loyalty. So then what actually makes a brand to possess these two particular characteristics or to become a strong brand? I think the key driver is differentiation and sufficient differentiation in the benefit of value proposition they offer to the customer. That will make a strong brand. What is strategic brand building? Strategic brand building uh, emphasizes a number of aspects. If you compare it with regular everyday brand building. First, strategic brand building focus on consumer insights. Especially today, with the help of big data analysis and artificial intelligence, organization needs to collect large amount of data in order to generate consumer insights. That should be the basis for strategic brand building. Number two, strategic brand building is a systematic efforts 
in developing consumer awareness of the brand and developing consumer strong preference for the brand. Third, strategic brand building has to be long-term. That also involves every member of the entire organization. So strategic brand building is not in the hand of just the marketing or communication department. It's organizational level efforts, which aim at building strong brands in the long run.